Hey everybody, it's Robert Hudgens. Yes, I'm the other half of the beautiful Melissa Hudgens who you've seen the videos from. But today, I'm just gonna show you the five moves for tonight's workout. And please forgive me, Melissa and I just got finished doing our workout ourselves. But let me just show you the five moves that you have. They're all pretty simple. And I'm gonna show you how you can either modify it to make it less intense or turn up the heat. First one is gonna be butt kickers. It sounds exact, it is exactly how it sounds. You're basically just gonna sit here. Now, if you can't get them up that high, just do what you can, okay? Or if you really didn't wanna go for it, get your arms involved. So that's that, okay? The next one is called a vertical knee crunch. It's basically, you're gonna take your hands, put it behind your head, and then you're just gonna bring your knee up to your chest just like this. Make sure that you really engage the cage, as they say. Suck your belly button into your spine as much as you can and bring your knee up as high as you can. All right, if you need to modify, don't bring it up so high. But try to go for it for the first few reps anyway, all right? Next one is your favorite. I'm sure you're already cussing us because of this one, but it's called the Russian twist, okay? There's different ways that you can do this, but basically what you're doing is just reaching down, touching your knuckles, on each side. You want to turn up the heat a little bit? Go ahead and raise your legs up a little bit. Do it like this. If you want to turn up the heat a lot of it, straighten out your legs and go to the side, okay? That's a Russian twist. Next one is a good old lunge. You've seen these two before, but we're going to go forward. Now you're just going to lunge forward. Try to get a 90 degree angle in both legs, okay? One thing that you've got to make sure that you don't do is take that knee out in front of your toes. That's really bad back here, okay? To modify, don't go down quite as much. If you want to go crazy, get down really low, okay? But you're going to do that and just alternate them, okay? Last one is push-ups. Now, there are different ways that you can do this one too. Let me show you the modified way. You're just going to go to a wall, take your feet out a little bit from the wall, and you're just gonna do what you can as far as come down. Go ahead and bring your hands a little bit about chest level and come down like that, okay? You wanna make it a little bit more difficult? Scoot out further from the wall, okay? Also, if you feel like that's not enough for you, and I recommend trying to do the hardest ones for the first couple of reps. Go from your knees, do push-ups like this, and then if you really wanna go for it, normal push-ups, okay? Take about 30 second breaks in between each round, but try to do all of these in succession if you can, like one right after the other. Take a 30 second to a minute break in between each round and do all your rounds, okay? Stay tuned, Melissa's gonna be showing you a video or announcing something as far as a great contest that we'll have for the last two days of this. So make sure you stay tuned, show us a, a nice sweaty picture, let us know that you did these and how you felt, all right? Take care, bye-bye.